Hey everyone, and a massive welcome back to another video here on the channel. Today, we're embarking on an exciting journey. We're going to transform your trusty Redmi Note 7 Pro by installing the absolute latest, a cutting edge ROM based on Android 16. Now, why Android 16 and why this particular ROM? Well, this isn't just any custom ROM. This is a build based on Pure, AOSB, the Android open source project. Before we dive into the technical steps, let's cover a crucial prerequisite. For this installation, you absolutely must have the recommended. Dynamic recovery already flashed on your Redmi Note 7 Pro. Also, and this is super important, back up everything you value on your phone. Photos, videos, documents, contacts, anything you can't bear to lose. All right, assuming you've got your dynamic recovery in place and all your precious data backed up, Let's get down to business. Make sure your phone has at least 50 to 60% battery. Life to avoid any mid-process power-offs. First things first, power off your Redmi Note 7 Pro completely. Once it's off, press and hold the power button and the volume up button simultaneously. Keep holding them until you see the orange Fox recovery menu appear on your screen. Once you're in recovery, navigate to the wipe section. This is a critical step for a clean installation preventing any old data from interfering with your new ROM. Here's what you need to wipe. Dalvik slash art cache. Cache data. Swiping to confirm these three wipes is essential for a stable new installation. After performing the regular wipes, go back to the main recovery menu and select format data. This is different from the wipe data we just did. Format data performs a deeper factory reset like wipe of your internal storage ensuring no remnants of your previous ROM are left behind that could cause conflicts. When prompted, type yes to confirm. Again, this will erase everything on your internal storage. So double check your backups. Now for the main event, installing the Android 16 ROM itself. Go back to the main recovery menu and select install. You'll then navigate to where you've saved your downloaded Android 16 ROM file, select it, and then simply swipe to confirm the flash. The installation process will begin, and this can take several minutes, depending on the size of the ROM and your device's speed. Once the flashing process completes successfully, you'll see a Reboot System button. Tap that. Your phone will now restart. And that's it. If you followed these steps correctly, your Redmi Note 7 Pro should now be booting into a fresh, clean, and blazing fast Android 16 based on pure USB. If you found this video helpful, please smash that like button it really helps the channel out. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. And hit the notification bell so you don't miss our next tech adventure. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Happy flashing!